Hi, this is Steve Martin with TransWest Truck Trailer RV, and welcome to our TransWest Facebook Live video today. I'm with the lovely Cherish. She's our videographer, and uh, she's kind of the heart and soul of this operation. So anyway, today I'm going to show you. We're going to look at the new, the 2020 Base Star 3226. It's stock number 5N200165. So in Newmar fashion, uh, everything that they do, whether it's their entry level gas motorhome class A or their top of the line diesel pusher, they build them the same way. When we start off, I like to talk about the formed fiberglass front clip. Uh, this is something a lot of companies do, but a lot don't. Uh, so they can make all these intricate curves and angles and stuff with form formed fiberglass, just like a boat. And then they put the seam from the side wall to the front clip on the side so you don't get water infiltration and air and noise, road noise and stuff. And that's real important when you're looking at a Class A motorhome. Um, then as we walk around the front, this is your engine bay. This is a V10, Ford V10, 320 horsepower, gas engine, six speed Ford transmission. Uh, here's your battery chassis in the front, all your fillers and uh, everything is in the front real easy to get to. So they started six speed transmission about two or three years ago. They went from four speed to five speed to six speed. At the, when they were four speed transmissions, they were 350 horsepower. When they moved to six speed, they were able to lower the horsepower, raise the torque and have more gears and di different shifting points. And it made a completely different coach than what it was before. The six speed is definitely the way to go. If you haven't driven one with a new six speed, six speed it's, you, you should really do that at some point. So anyway, you can see here, uh, all of all of Newmar's uh, motor homes, whether they're gas or diesel, are uh, full body paint. It's their masterpiece finish. It's a multi-layered automotive finish. There's no decals to dry and crack and fade. So it has an automotive clear coat on it. And as you move up in line, they just it just gets deeper and deeper the coats of paint. But this is a beautiful coach. Uh, for the price range that, that it's in as an entry level gas coach. Very easy to operate. It's got 22 and a half inch wheels and aluminum wheels, Alcoa aluminum wheels, not steel wheels and hubcaps. That's real important. Taller the tire, the less revolutions, the better the ride. Um, I want to show you something here. Let me run this slide in, Cherish. This is something that's real important that is exclusive to Numar and gas coaches. There's a couple of other companies doing it in diesel pushers. But these are, this kind of has to do with their sidewalls, their front molded fiberglass, and all these parts go together to really give some great benefits. So this is a flush slide. Um, if you can imagine building this wall, this is a 16 inch on center structural wall. This is not a laminated wall. Um, if it's laminated, it can delaminate. If it's not laminated, it can never delaminate. And then they cut holes in the side. And you can imagine cutting this hole in here plumb and level enough to make this slide work properly. So most companies, all companies in the gas motorhome industry, they overlap. They have a piece of molding here that overlaps this crack right here. And uh, so they don't have to get as accurate on their opening in the wall as Numar does to do a flush slide. So the benefit of this flush slide is less air, less wind noise, less water infiltration, and then they include a mechanical and sometimes electric slide lock to hold this in so this, this slide doesn't wiggle around when you're going down the road. So it's, uh, it's just one of their quality uh, assets that they do. All frameless, insulated glass windows, okay? Uh, really heavy duty screen doors. They make their own screen doors. So as you can tell, I have the jacks down now so it's not gonna rock, but it's a really heavy duty screen door. It's not a 
one that flops in the wind and bends all up. It's got a almost full length electric awning. Um, that's a, I believe it's an A&E awning for 2020. Side hinge, storage bays, insulated doors. So this is all carpeted inside for kind of cuts down on road noise and stuff like that. You have your inverter, 1200 watt inverter on this coach. Uh, the floor is insulated. I believe it's an R19 or an R. Yeah, I believe it's an R19 floor and then the ceiling is an R19. So it's very well insulated on the bottom sides. These walls are 16 inch on center structural walls with fiberglass residential insulation in and on the inside there's five eighths of foam and wall board. So the, the, the walls are actually thicker than an inch and a half like most companies. And it's like I said, it's non-laminated. That's why when you look down the side of a Numar, the walls look much straighter. They don't bow as much as a vacuum bonded or pinch rolled laminated wall does. Okay. Just more storage. This is a water tank here, and then you have a little bit of storage left in here. Uh, some control devices in here. Uh, 120 volt outlet. All these storage bays are lit with a light. Um, this is your generator. All Onan Cummins Onan. I believe this is a 5500 gas generator. This has two air conditioners on it, two 15,000 watt uh, heat pump air conditioners on top. You can hear that generator's running right now and it's pretty quiet. More storage. Can't have enough storage. If you're like me, you take too much stuff anyway. All lit. And this is pass-through storage of this. So your, your long stuff, fishing poles, tent poles, if you bring a tent or whatever, can go in here. And not a lot of uh, Class A formats have pass-through storage like this does. So that's a big plus, another benefit of uh, owning a Numar. Once again, molded fiberglass rear clip. No side joints, the joints are, no corner joints, the joints are on the side, so you don't get any leakage here. And uh, most companies, this laminated wall, a, a laminated wall on the side and a laminated wall in the back and they have a corner joint and that's where they start to warp and leak water and it creates a big mess. 5,000 pound tow capacity on this coach. It's got side cameras and rear cameras. So you can tow, you know, any kind of Jeeps or Hondas or uh, things like that. I tow a Equinox. I mean, uh, excuse me, a terrain this is about 4,000 pounds. All LED lighting on all the tail lights and lights all around. Let me back up here on this um, on this slide, this flush slide. They all have awning toppers on them, so when the slide comes out, an awning comes out with it, and that just uh, cuts down on pine needles, pine cones, snow silt and stuff like that so when you get ready to leave you don't have to get up there and get a ladder out and brush off the top of the slide to roll it in so you don't wear out your seals very important around here is your is your power cord it's a 50 amp power cord with a uh, uh, automatic transfer switch on it so if your generator starts, you don't have to plug in or anything. You have a cable hookup. If you're at a park that has satellite, you can hook up to their cable or their satellite. It's all lit also. Uh, here's your gas fill. And I believe that is sewer hose storage right there. It's all uh, unleaded gas, 
E15 unleaded gas. Another storage bay. Something that's new for 2020. They've isolated this dump station over here where you have your gray and black water dump. They've isolated it here so if you get any leaks or anything like that when you're dumping, it doesn't spill over into your water bay. So that makes keeps it a lot cleaner and nicer. It kind of isolates all of your uh, sewage and water drainage. Over here is hot and cold running water and a shower. You can wash off everything, a whole house um, filter. Fresh water uh, fill, city connection. Turn your water pump on and off here. More storage, 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 storage. Uh, that is your bypass for your winterizing hose there. So it's real easy to winterize. You don't have to pull hoses off of the pump and put them on the other side to reverse the pump. It's just a bypass switch that you turn on and turn the pump on and it sucks the, the uh, antifreeze out of the cans or out of the buckets or whatever it comes in uh, to winterize. More storage. Then here are your um, house batteries. And I believe this unit has six house batteries because this has a residential refrigerator. So there's two additional batteries for that residential 120 volt refrigerator. And it has a big inverter that uh, inverts that from 120 volt to 12 volts so you can run it off your batteries. It's a 25 gallon LP tank. That's not pounds, that's gallons. Uh, my motorhome, I fill up my LP tank about once every two years. Uh, they, they really last a long time, these big tanks like this. Back around here to the front, side cameras, like I mentioned a while ago. Uh, just a beautiful coach. It has a walk-on roof. It's a, it's a rubber roof, fabric roof that's a walk-on roof on the Bay Stars and Bay Star Sports. Beautiful coach, especially for an entry-level coach. It's the best in the industry in a, in a Class A gas coach. You want to go inside? Cherish is hot, so she wants to go inside where the air conditioning is. This is a new color for this year. These are Arctic white cabinets. They're really popular. Uh, it's kind of what everybody wants. Um, the outside color on this unit is sterling. I believe they had that last year, but these are Ar Arctic white maple cabinets. It's a solid wood door. Uh, has all this accent lighting, reading lights. Just a beautiful coach at night. All these valances, upholstered to valances uh, around all the windows. These are all jealousy windows, as I said earlier. They are dual pane windows, and they're jealousy windows with that front door open and open at this. I can, it's almost blowing my hair right here. Uh, a sleeper sofa. This makes into a queen bed. You can sleep two adults this way. This, Put that slide out. Huh? Oh, yeah, let me put the slide back out. I thought it seemed kind of crowded in here. Here's the slide locks that I was talking about earlier. So you have flush slide and you have, it says manual slide locks. So when this slide is in, this locks it in place so it doesn't move around when you're going down the road. This is Newmar's patented slide mechanism. They started doing in the early 90s, I think like in 91. Um, and they still use it today. It's a very simple system, it's patented, uh, and it just very hardly ever breaks down. Uh, this year for 2020, all the TVs were, they used to be Vizio, now they're all Samsung. Bose speakers and Samsung TVs. Huh? 4K? 4K Samsung uh, TVs. I believe this unit has a, uh, it does, it has a wine guard. Uh, in motion satellite dish. So I believe that's with Dish Network, it would be HD. Um, control panel up here. This is all your 
satellite turn off. It's got heating pads on the tanks. Okay, if you use this in the winter time or whatever, you can keep your tanks heated. Uh, all your slide operations, battery disconnect, inverter controller, the awning. It's got LED lights on the awning, electric awning. And it's got the old overhead bunk. Let me drop this down. This comes down and folds out. Okay? And then has side panels so the kids won't fall out. But you can sleep one adult, one kid up there. It's out of the way. Very easy to operate. The dash is pretty much basic. It's got two LED uh, monitors um, and uh, Ford's six speed transmission, as I said. It's got steering wheel controls for your cruise control, uh, equalizer system, hydraulic levelers. Uh, just a real easy coach to operate um, and drive. And like I said, with that new six-speed transmission and the 320 horsepower V10, this thing runs like a champ. And keep it at 65, gets pretty good gas mileage as well. Uh, in true new Newmar fashion, on every side window of every coach, from the Bay Star up to the King Air, they have a, uh, product, a brand specialist picture. This particular person is Steve Bozier. You have his phone number, it's 24-7. He has his phone on all the time. You can get a hold of him. You can go to Noogle, which is their website that answers about any kind of questions you would have about a Newmar. Uh, Newpar, which is their parts department. And then you have a number for Ford or something with the chassis where to go awry or something. It would, uh, you have a number to get a hold of them. And then we have our in-house uh, service advisors that you can get a hold of if something happens and you can't figure it out. How does she look, Cherish? Good. Got the thumbs up. Um, both of these chairs turn around. I believe, yes, this has a foot rest on this chair. This one's very usable. This one's fairly usable. It's a little cumbersome with the steering wheel sometimes, but you can, they do both turn around and become part of the living area. This has a table and four chairs. There's two chairs that are stationary chairs, and there's two chairs under the bed that are upholstered and folding chairs that match. And you've got this really deep buffet. The women love this, this floor plan because of all the countertop space. Um, all solid surface countertops. All solid surface over here. Two double uh, stainless steel sinks. And these are heavy duty sinks. These are residential quality sinks, okay? This is not one of those kind of sinks, stainless steel sinks that you turn the water on full blast and it splatters all over you. Kitchen window, I believe, is an option on this. Uh, here's your microwave uh, with a turntable, basic stuff. Fantastic fan, it's on right now. Uh, the control is right here. Okay, so you can set it for a certain temperature or just turn it on manually and set it to high, medium, or low. And uh, right now, we're in here with a door open and one window, and I can feel the air moving through here right now. And there's at least two of those. Yeah, there's two in this coach. Residential refrigerator. It's a big deal. It's where everybody's going to. No more looking for propane. This unit does have a propane water heater, 10-gallon uh, propane water heater, and a LP... Uh, furnace and an LP cooktop here. I think it's a three burner cooktop. Uh, so you still have to have LP gas, but you don't have to have LP gas for your refrigerator. So residential refrigerator, it's 120 volt. So that's what the that's what the additional um, inverter is for, is to operate this on your batteries. So as you're going down the road, it operates. If you're dry camping, it's operating off the batteries. Uh, if the batteries run low, you can turn the generator on or start the engine and it'll charge them back up fairly quickly. Big pantry. You don't see a lot of pantries that size in a coach this size and in this price range.
Um, another pantry. Lots of storage. All finished maple inside for the shelves. Okay, as we move back here to the bedroom. Can I look at the bathroom? Oh, we passed the bathroom. I looked at it, but I didn't show anybody else. Um, full walk-in shower. You can kind of step in there. Solid surface countertop with a sink. Full wall mirror up on the back of the door. So just the little things that Numar does they kind of put their touch to things like a beveled glass full length mirror. The women love that. I love it. Porcelain sink, not a plastic sink. So people want to know, I mean toilet. Um, people want to know what's the big deal with a porcelain toilet versus plastic. It's just much easier to clean and stays much more sanitized. Is the big deal and it lasts longer. Fantastic fan, LED lighting throughout the coach. It's a good looking coach. Okay, now the master. Wardrobes on each side of the TV here. It's, it's, yeah. um, all LED lights, all lit inside, which is really nice. Samsung TVs. They don't jump around a, one brand in the living room or one brand in the in the bedroom, one brand outside, they're all match system. They're all the same. They're all Samsung this year. King bed for a 32 foot coach. King bed and lots of room to move around. They have widened this a little bit because of people's complaints about trying to get around the bed and making the bed. You've got plenty of room. I'm kind of a big guy, but I could even make this bed. I'm not saying I will, but I'm saying I can. All LED accent lighting, reading lights underneath, more storage. Uh, you've got little grommets and stuff in here for a 120 volt outlet for like CPAP machines and stuff. That was another thing they added. Uh, you got place to put them up in here and you got a place to run the hoses down and stuff if you unfortunately have to do that. Did you see all, did you show all the drawers down here under the, the dresser drawers? And then up here is all of your there's two Sony Blu-ray players, one in the front, one in the back here. That comes standard. And then you have a place for your satellite receivers and anything else you might want to add to the system. Well, I think that just about does it today for our Facebook Live video. Miss Cherish and I, we're glad to be with you folks. My name is Steve Martin. And my cell number is 970-290-6120, or I can be reached at steve.martin at transwest.com. We'd love to have you folks out. If there's a particular coach that you want to see, you might have seen this one before, but if there's a particular coach you want to see, new or used, give me a call and I'll be happy to do a walk around on it and show you, or that's if you're not comfortable coming out yet, or you can... Uh, Call me and we'll set a time to come out and I'll take, take them for a drive, take a look at them. We'd love to have you out. So thanks for your time today and be safe. Thanks.